Doing real good here. Thanks. Two thousand dollars. Take a look. Al dente is often used to describe a preparation of which of the following foods? Meat, fish, pasta, cake. Uh, as I recall, I think al dente is pasta that's a little harder than whatever the other Italian term would be, which I don't know. So, C, pasta. C, pasta. Final answer. Final answer. You just won $2,000. Very good. All right, that sound means we're out of time for tonight, but Dan will be back here Tuesday night, and joining him will be 10 new contestants from all over the country. And they are Larry Lamb, Joel Vincent, Kevin Siglowski, Jason Dettelbach, Joe Bartolomeo, Tom Winston, Carol McNellis, Alan Elliott, Alan Peterman, and Kate Patton. Thank you very much. Hello again, everybody, and uh, welcome back. The series continues, but now we really are a regular television series. We're on Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday nights. So those of you who are completely addicted will have to find something else to do on those other four nights, and I'm sure you will, too. Sometimes, though, it seems like everybody in the country is watching this show, but the question that Dan Blonsky from Miami, our contestant tonight, had the other night was, El McPherson, are you out there? Are you watching? happens that he is a big fan of this beautiful model and said it would be a thrill to meet her while he's here in New York. And Dan, you know what happened? What happened? Only on television, pal. Nothing! <laughs> she never called. Well, you know, Regis... Get I, over it! I, sh I should have gone for the single supermodel. It was a yeah, mistake. There you go. But anyway, welcome back to, uh, to our show. And your mom is up there. What, what is your mother? Hope, uh, what, what do you do? I teach. You teach? Mm -hmm. What uh, grade? I teach pre-K, four-year-olds. Oh my gosh, it would seem like only yesterday that young Dan was in that class. I don't know. <laughs> okay, you've won $2,000. You're nine questions away from winning one million bucks. The rules are simple. The more questions you get right, the more money you win. Once you reach the $32,000 level, you're guaranteed to leave with at least that much money. All of your three lifelines are intact. 50-50, where the computer will take away two of the wrong answers, leaving the correct answer and one wrong answer. Ask the audience where you can poll our studio audience to see what they think the answer is. Finally, you can phone a friend, where our friends at AT&T will help you call anyone anywhere in the country to see if they can help you out. So, Dan, if you are ready, why don't we do it? Why don't we play Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Here we go. $4,000, Dan. Here it comes. Which New York City building was bombed by terrorists in 1993? Grand Central Terminal, World Trade Center, City Hall, Empire State Building. Well, I, I remember that event. Um, I don't remember where I was at the time, but I remember the event. And they bombed uh, the World Trade Center. The Final answer? Final answer. World Trade Center, he says. He's right for $4,000. Eight questions away from $1 million going for $8,000, and here it comes. In the film Notting Hill, where does Hugh Grant's character work? At a bookstore, in a clothing store, a restaurant, antique shop. I did not see the movie. Um, I read a review of it, so I have an idea. But just to be comfortable, I think I'll, I'll poll the audience on this one. Gonna poll the audience. Audience, we need a little help here for Dan. On your keypads using A, B, C, or D, please vote now. Wow, 88% feel it's a, a bookstore. Well, it's nice when the audience uh, supports what you thought it was, so uh, I'm going to go with A, bookstore. Okay, is that your final answer? That is my final answer. Final answer. Everybody's right, it was a bookstore. Yeah. 
Very romantic movie. He was working at a bookstore she wanted in. Could have been you and Elle McPherson. Could have been. <laughs> Going for $16,000, Dan. Take a look. Panama borders which of the following countries to connect Central and South America? Ecuador, Venezuela, Nicaragua, Colombia. All right. I'm... I know they just gave back the Panama Canal, and I read about... Panama becoming independent, uh, really because the U.S. wanted to build a canal. And I'm trying to remember whether it's Venezuela or Colombia it became independent from. I think I've got my South American map in my head, and uh, Colombia is the country that Panama borders. Say it's Colombia. That's what I believe. Going to be your final answer? That will be my final answer. You're right, it's Colombia. You won $16,000. Okay, doing good this guy. Won $16,000, going for 32. Two lifelines are left. Six away from a million dollars. We'll be right back. All right, we're back now, and uh, Dan Blonsky from uh, Miami, Florida, is in the hot seat right now. He's won sixteen thousand dollars. How do you feel now? I feel good. Feel good. I understand that before you came here, you were reluctant to tell your friends down there in Florida that you were coming here. Why? Well, I, I didn't want to get up here and, and blow like a $300 question. I'd, I'd rather not get up here. Well, you think nobody would notice you were here if you didn't tell them? <laughs> well, if, if I was hiding in the back and didn't get up here, it'd be all right. Oh, I see what you're saying, yeah. But you're in, you're in pretty good shape right now. So you're going you're for 32000 You're six away from $1 million. And are you ready? I am. Well, why don't we do it? Let's play. Come on, here we go. What did the 45-foot-tall Hollywood sign say when it was originally built in 1923? Hollywood CA? Hello, Hollywood? Hollywoodland? Hollywoodville? There's an advantage to watching a lot of TV, and, and one of the advantages is I know, I don't, I don't remember who was, who died in a mystery or scandal, but I saw in mysteries or scandals that some starlet died and the sign was Hollywood Land, which was a development or something they were doing. Good so, eyes. Hollywood Land is my final answer. Final answer, Hollywood Land. For $32,000, you got it! Yeah.